Hallo Bowling Freunde. Hi everyone. Salut à Mühlhaus Gingersheim. I hope it's fine. <laughs> My French is so terrible, but I I really I I want to practice it. We are in the beautiful town of Mühlhaus Gingersheim uh, to play a Team Storm Challenge Cup with four people against other teams, of course. And um, yeah, this is the first time for us. Uh, Torsten, Tyler, Martin, and I. I, I am, we are on the road this time, and um, we are really looking forward to doing some strikes in France for the very first time and meeting some friends because I've been riding with some of the French players for a longer time, but I haven't seen them yet. So first time that we get to see each other, looking forward to this. And um, yeah, of course, also looking forward for, uh, to a great competition. And uh, there will be a lot of great players in there. Uh, you will see this in, in, the, in some shots uh, that I um, show you in this uh, video. And uh, yeah, I hope that we can manage to succeed at least a little bit, maybe uh, win uh, the, uh, the one or the other game and um, maybe also win some of our money back because I, I, I mean, it, it took us some uh, money in order to get here and also to stay here and yeah, so the trip costs a lot but um, thanks again for uh, Harold for the sponsorship um, of you, uh, thank you very much and um, yeah, um, We are hoping that we can continue to do this uh, much more often because um, those are the things that we really look forward to if we are a bowler, right? We want to compete against the best bowlers of Europe and yeah, so um, let's have a look how we manage to do. The, the game will be like that. We have four games, then we have a little break and then we have uh, another four games and tomorrow there are there is the same, almost the same block again. We have another four games tomorrow, a little break and then afterwards three games. And if we are the first in our group, we would play against the uh, first in the other group uh, for the tournament uh, champion. So a great mode. Um, hopefully we can manage to, do some, to shoot something nice. Uh, enjoy the video. Ah, subscribe guys, subscribe. Abonnieren. We need every kind of subscription. Abonnieren. Recap after four games. Uh, after recap, I played <laughs> terrible. I have to admit, I played You're really. Trying to order big freaking Burger King <laughs> here, and you trying to. <laughs> what? Recap? While we are at uh, Burger King, uh, I thought it's the best time to do a little recap after four games. And um, yeah, I have to say, um, 
my my spare ball is pretty terrible uh, today. I have I have like already seven seven open frames already. Um, make seven makeables uh, I missed. Um, I do had a great line with the gem uh, at the beginning, but I I failed to execute, and um, yeah, it was like. 180, 200, 170, 170 or something like that. So it's uh, quite terrible for me. Uh, Thorsten, how's it for you? What? How's it for you? How's it for me? Yeah. For me, yeah, it is. Man merkt schon, it's very anspruchsvoll. Man muss das Spiel schon beherrschen. Und man muss es halt und räumen, so man am wichtigsten. Yeah. Yeah, so he, he he basically says that uh, he notices that it's really hard to play and you really have to execute nicely and if you don't, you are just punished. And that's exactly what happened to us in three out of four games because we lost three and we won one. And uh, yeah, that's basically good. Mari, how was it for you? Yeah, so Basically, this is uh, all Martin's gonna say. Um, <laughs> for me, I actually played super terrible uh, the first game with only 120. Uh, I totally missed the single pins. I had like six open frames. And um, yeah, I still ended up doing like 180 average. Um, but yeah, the spares are actually my main concern. If I had to lie, I'm at least at like 13 opens in like uh, four games now, so definitely too much. But yeah, let's hope to improve. We kind of get a feeling for the lanes now, and we're trying to order Burger King here, but trust me, like trying to talk English. On. On. Merci beaucoup. Yeah, we're just, we're just doing our best here, and uh, yeah, that's basically it. Peace out. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs>
Push. Hit it. Oh, yeah. Hey guys, recap after the first day. I'm uh, sitting right now in the hotel in uh, Mühlehaus uh, Kingersheim, I think is the, is the town. And um, yeah, we played the first eight games today in a very, very beautiful alley, I have to admit. It's one of the most beautiful alleys I've ever been to. I mean, I haven't been to many, but I think it's in my top three, I would say. If you... If you had a look at the banner at the at the start, uh, uh, the LED, uh, which is over the entire uh, thirty six uh, lanes, it's 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 amazing. So a uh, very beautiful alley, and um, yeah, it was um, it was a very beautiful first day. I have to admit, it was um, um, it was fun. It was a lot of fun to play. Actually, it could have been more fun if I. <laughs> would have uh, shot something better because uh, I think I have a, a 187 average, with, which is quite bad, <laughs> I have to admit. It's one of the, the worst uh, averages that I've uh, had uh, in, yeah, in a few days, I would say, or even a few weeks. Um, but I have, to, I have to be on the positive side. I mean, it's, it was the first time in France. It was the first time, of course, in that alley, um it was a lot of firsts uh today and uh, so sometimes there are, if you have a lot of things that you cannot really 100% control or predict then of course it's it's hard but one thing i have to say my spare game today was terrible if i would give myself like uh school grades uh from uh a to f uh then i would say that my my um yeah my my first chats were like in the b to c sometimes b sometimes c some very rare shots which were like really really great um i i, I sometimes struggled with being a little bit too uh careful with the release um i i, I have to be much more aggressive tomorrow and um, yeah, but this is what I take from the first day. So for me, first shot was like a B or a C, but my spare game, an F. It's an F today. I have like 13 open frames. I have exactly 13 open frames. Uh, and I only counted the ones uh, which I could make. I, I missed 13 makeable spares that you cannot do this in, uh, on this uh, level. And the, the problem was just like, um, I'm just more, uh, uh, how can I say it, more, um, um, I'm just more used to uh, having those lanes that, that hook a lot when I, when I shoot my spares. And uh, the middle part of the lanes over here, they were so slippery that as soon as you uh, did not really go straight at the spares, you missed a ton of them. So I had to uh, rearrange my entire spare system. And once I did that, it, it, what, it went better. I, I had then two or three games, which I did not miss one. But uh, other than that, I mean, 13 open frames, it, it, it speaks for itself. I, I mean, this, these are at least 150, 160 pins that I lost only for 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 spare shooting and i consider myself normally a good spare shooter so i have to be better for tomorrow and now i'm starving and we got gonna go uh and eat something we i think we we, we deserve this after this long day and yeah well i'm really looking forward for day two um got a lot of things to uh to improve for tomorrow and yeah, it was it was great. Anyways, uh, we, we we met a lot of friends from France, and uh, we we met Emma's team, and Emma shot a really great game in, in the last uh, in the last set. Um, so it was it was cool uh, overall. So see you tomorrow, guys. Have a good one.
Um, I'm English, but I'm trying to speak French. Um, J'ai uh, une réservation um, pour uh, uh, par, uh, par, uh, um, uh, par, uh, um, pour uh, um, um, uh, Spada Mannheim. Yeah, uh, André Duit. André Duit. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 Oui, yeah. Mm -hmm. oui. Oh, yeah, I speak English. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the, 